With the Europe Large Mid Cap Pick List, we select attractively priced names from the European Market Large Mid Cap Index. This is not a model portfolio, but more intended as inspiration and as an idea generator for investors looking for interesting European equities across multiple sectors. Relatively speaking, technology is now the most expansive sector in the index. The average stock is trading at a premium of 21% to the fair value we use it for. The energy sector is still the cheapest, with a discount of 24% over relative to the fair value. The entrants to this month's Europe Large Mid Cap Pick list are mainly in the financial sector, which contributed an insurer and a bank. The list includes the following four names. Aegon. The Dutch insurer is in the midst of a turnaround, divesting non-core businesses. We hope this continues. Recently, the businesses in Central and Eastern Europe have already been divested. Debt service has also been impressive so far. We are also pleased with the new CEO, Lard Fries. He has years of experience in the insurance industry and works decisively. We use a fair value of 4.95 euros for Aegon, where the share now trades around 3.5 euros. Orange. This telecom provider is the market leader in France. Orange has the best network and close ties with the government. It also has a leading position as a builder of the fiber optic network in France. The group is also represented in Africa, which can act as a growth engine. Other European telecom companies lack that. The fair value for Orange is 13.9 euros, while there is now about 9.5 euros on the plates. Glencore. Swiss origin Glencore has a global network of merchants and logistics capabilities, resulting in very clear economies of scale. In 2013, Glencore merged with British Swiss Extrata. Access to Extrata's mining output enables the combined companies to extract more value production volume. Glencore is more diversified than other large mining companies. It has great exposure to late cycle commodities such as nickel, cobalt, and copper. The fair value for Glencore is 335 GBX pence for the stock, and it is now trading at 316 GBX. Stellantis. Stellantis was created in 2021 after the merger of Fiat Chrysler Automobiles and PSA Pugiat Citrion. The group carries 14 car brands. The new parent company promotes economies of scale. The company's top management expects that 80% of the targeted 5 billion euros in synergy benefits will be achieved in the fourth year after the merger. Prices have improved thanks to the lower stock of company cars during the pandemic and the production shortage caused by the chip shortage. That is favorable for the margins in the future. The global rollout of premium brands such as DS, Citroën's luxury brand, Jeep, and Maserati will increase average revenue per car sold and improve profitability.